I was one of the first law graduates of JCU's law faculty and I graduated in 1992. Because of the small cohort that I had, we got on really well, we supported each other. We still continue with our friendships. I'm able to ring one of them when I need to run something past them. We continue to support each other in our professions. My first couple of years here were living at Uni Hall and studying hard. The thing I remember the most at that time was coming over to the library and looking up on the reading list, finding all those old law reports. And now I'm a barrister in Brisbane, practicing at the private bar, mostly specialising in criminal law. I'm honoured to be getting the Significant Achievement Award tonight. Um, it's really exciting to be back here in Townsville with James Cook again, and uh, it brings back a lot of fond memories. I was appointed as a magistrate in September of last year, 2018. I'm now stationed in Cairns, which is where I was actually born. Fortunately, during my career, I lectured in Cairns and Townsville with JCU, so I continued my engagement with JCU, and I'm continuing that on a, on a voluntary basis now as a magistrate um, sitting in Cairns. So, yes, yeah, so I devote my time to the court now. So I was appointed a judge of the district court in 2017, as I said at the time, and as I've continued to tell people since then, had I not done a law degree at James Cook University, I would never have become a lawyer, and I certainly would never have become a judge. So my advice to James Cook University law students is to make contacts early on. 